potentially toxic chemicals just dumped right on the side of the road. It's something people in the community have been dealing with for decades, and they say enough is enough. If you drive through Kapa'a Quarry Road in Kailua, you'll see anything from kids' toys to paint cans just chucked to the side. And the thing is, there's actually a transfer station on that road, but community leaders say people are still illegally dumping after hours. The city says it knows about this, so what's it doing about it? Bridget Namaka follows up. Bridget. Marissa, it's nicknamed Dump Road. Officials say the dumping along Kapa'a Quarry Road has been going on for too long. But now I'm told there will be more security to catch people in the act. The Kapa'a Transfer Station is on Kapa'a Quarry Road. But the community considers the entire length of the road an unofficial dump. That's just rude. It's messed up. It's really pretty out here, actually. But, um... I don't see any reason for it. The, the, the dump's right there. Tires, discarded shoes, a television, chairs, and other pieces of discarded garbage have been tossed to the side. We're on the side of Kapa'a Quarry Road, and it sure smells like a dump here. It is very strong, very pungent. Here's also something very troubling. Five-gallon buckets of chemicals, sealant, oozing into the ground. I called Representative Chris Lee, who calls the illegal dumping frustrating because it's next to Kavainui Marsh. What we've really seen are, in some cases, um, some contracting companies and others who don't want to pay the fee to be able to dispose of um, construction debris and other sorts of waste who just end up dumping it on the side of the road. It can't be tolerated, especially right next to a uh, world-recognized wildlife refuge. A Kailua neighborhood board member says she's seen more. They had dumped an entire household of items, garbage, uh, Wash machine, refrigerator, freezer, dishwasher, stove. Teresa Parsons says the issue is happening because the transfer site closes at 6 p.m. and people who don't make it on time just dump their trash on the road. She asked city spokesman Andrew Pereira during a neighborhood board meeting to extend the transfer site's hours. He said that it was complicated and would require opening negotiations with the union. And I said, well, we can't just keep going on forever like this. In an email, Pereira wrote the city recently got rid of an abandoned vehicle off Kapa'a Quarry Road and is monitoring the area for illegal dumping. City Council Member Ikaika Anderson also tells me he's asking HPD to patrol the area for signs of illegal dumpers. The city wants the public to let them know if they see any trash or illegal dumping on Kapa'a Quarry Road. You can call the Department of Customer Services. The number will be on our website. Bridget Namata, KHON 2 News.